Hey, what's going on everyone? We're back again with another video here. Um, today we're doing kind of an unboxing. I got this package in the mail from Amazon. Um, so uh, about a year ago now, um, I had a really bad rock chip hit my window in my car. And in an effort to kind of keep things clean and um, presentable, um, I'm gonna try a DIY for this. So um, let's get going. I actually got this uh, DIY recommendation from another YouTuber called Chris Fix. Um, he does a lot of really great car videos on how to kind of maintain your own vehicles at home in your driveway. So I uh, ordered this product through his link in his, uh, his description of his video. You can check out that video right up here. Just click on the link and head over to his channel. So this came from Amazon Prime. Um, took about two days, which isn't bad at all. Um, it's As a car guy, you know, we don't like to wait for our parts to come in. So two days is really great. Um, it's only just one box in here, but we're gonna open it up and kind of go over what's inside of it. All right, so now that we've got the package open, we're gonna go ahead and pull out the product itself. Um, it's a little squished, but I'm sure it'll be fine. It's in a clamshell case. It's by Permatex. Um, it is a windshield repair, complete repair system. Um, it looks like it comes with the windshield repair syringe and plunger, uh, repair compounds, adhesive disc, pedestal, curing strip, one push pin, one razor blade, one alcohol towelette, and one instruction sheet. So we're gonna go ahead and dive into this, kind of see what's in the actual kit itself. Just gonna peel off the edges here. And there we go, it's open. And uh, as you can see, the contents are just kind of bagged up right here. So in your clamshell you have this bag with all of the uh, pieces that it includes as well as your instructions. I'm going to go ahead and set this aside here. Um, I read a couple of reviews online of the instructions and people were saying that um, it doesn't tell you everything and this is a, I mean, this half is in Spanish but this is pretty lengthy instructions. Um, so yeah, it just kind of tells you exactly how to do it. Um, it's quite a few steps, but I've, I've watched uh, the video that Chris Fix made and I'm, I'm really just gonna go off of that because he explains it pretty well and I'm, I'm kind of a visual person. So, um, you know, I'll, I'll keep these handy, but I don't think I'm really gonna be referencing them during the actual process too much. So in our bag, you can see right here, it comes with everything that is included in the kit. I'm gonna go ahead and take these out and uh, lay them out for you to see. We've got an alcohol wipe. This is the disc. Uh, it comes with a safety pin, which is kind of interesting. Um, that's to take the glass away. Um, your resin, and this looks a lot smaller than I thought it would be, but um, I don't think we're about to use too much. Your plunger and syringe. Your adhesive disc. And your razor blade sure what this piece is but um, it's a little piece of plastic kind of film so there's all the pieces that come in the kit itself as you can see they're all laid out right here um, this kit does a really good job of providing all the things I mean even down to the um, the push pin to get the extra pieces of glass out of your chip um, this is really something you can buy and not have any of this at home Granted, you know, I do have a razor blade already and I do have a push pin and I have some alcohol to use as a cleaning agent. 
but this is really good for anyone who's, you know, wanting to do this but doesn't think they have all the things and they don't need to go out and buy them um, because they all come in your kit. So that's good for me. So that's it everyone. This is a really quick um, unboxing video for the Permatex windshield repair kit and it's actually the night before I'm doing this um, so tomorrow I'll actually be um, repairing the chip in my windshield and I know that it's something that you can just call insurance for you know you're supposed to have car insurance and they're able to help you out on this sort of thing but um, you know it's it's a little bit of a hassle to call, schedule an appointment, and then usually it's through a third party repair person that will actually come out and repair the windshield. So being the kind of DIY type person that I am, and everyone likes to work on their cars, you know, even if it's just repairing a windshield or repairing a touch-up paint. So basically I'm just going to take this as the opportunity to spend a little bit of time working on the car and hopefully the results come out as expected, but stay tuned.